We at the Wall Street Journal are a daily newspaper. We publish every day uh, except for Sunday. So it can be a little bit challenging. When I was younger, it was much harder, especially Friday afternoons in the winter, covering um, really volatile financial markets. So I was nervous back then, but I stuck to my guns and I kinda, it wasn't a choice for me. So when there's no choice, people realize it's not a choice and they do respect it. The one time there was a huge story that I couldn't write about, uh, there's this individual, Bill Gross, and he's among the best known investors on Wall Street. And I spent the whole year with my colleague writing about him and his firm. And then it was two days of Rosh Hashanah into Shabbos. I picked up the paper, Shabbos morning, and I read in my own paper about how, about how this Bill Gross, this individual had quit suddenly and shockingly from his firm. And that was my story. And I felt horrible that I let my, my colleagues down and they were okay about it and they did fine on their own, but people were tweeting about how it was a little bit like Sandy Koufax. So I felt bad personally, but I felt it was nice that there was a message sent that even on the most important story of the year, I wasn't gonna work that day and everyone knew that. So I went out to Houston at the beginning of my book project and I was a little nervous, a from a yid from uh, the East Coast going out to meet an oil baron. We didn't have much in common. He started telling me a story about his father who's actually an immigrant from Greece who changed his name from Savas Paraskofopoulos to Mitchell. And I told him my own story where my grandfather got off the boat and they changed his name from Rumshinsky to Zuckerman so we could relate. And you'd be surprised how many people I can relate to orthodoxy and the journey that we've all gone through. There are a lot of religious people in the heartland of America who really appreciate um, what we care about and how we live our life and the discipline and um, what, what's important to us.